Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing another review. This product is from a company called Basis. Now, this is their wireless three coil charger. On the back of the package here, you have some basic information. 5 volt, 2 amp, 9 volt, 1.67 amp. It is a USB type C. It's 10 watts. Uh, it is a vertical three coil design. It does charge vertical and horizontal, meaning it lays flat and it stands up has a built-in stand and the base around the edges are made completely from aircraft grade aluminum. Now when you buy a basis product you will get a scratch off code here. You might want to check that every time you get a basis product because there are fakes out there and you want to make sure you're getting a quality product and this company here, Basis, they do make some very nice quality products. This is the packaging. Now inside the package you will be greeted with the main device, of course. Okay, and under that, you will have your USB Type-C, some little pamphlets, some of their other products, other wireless chargers, your warranty card, and your instruction manual. It's Chinese and this is English, explaining all of the options and features. Now, as for the charger itself, like I stated earlier, it is made from aluminum and plastic. This edge right here is all aluminum and it is very well done. You have your USB Type-C port, and on the back here, you have your built-in stand, which you just pop off, and you slide it in through the front, like that. It's got a nice little rubber mat here to hold your device, and you just stand it up like that. I know it's kind of hard to see at this camera angle, but it is a nice incline. I don't have a phone on me as of right now to show you, but... It does work nice. We've got this little back sticker here showing you some more information. The inputs of the wireless charger. To put the back back on, you just slide one end in and pop it together. You have some venting holes here, some rubber pads. Keep it nice and firm on the ground. Now, it's made out of like a rubbery plastic material, so it's it's got a nice grip and nice feel to it. Your phone's not going to slide off. Now, you have three coils in here. You have one, two, and three. It's got these little dots here for placing. Uh, that's basically the best possible place you can place your phone. Like I said, this is a USB Type-C device, so I will be plugging this in. And on the opposite side here, you will have some lights. Here, let me restart that so you can see the startup process. Okay. Flashes a few times just to show you that it is working, it is calibrated and ready to go. Now, unfortunately, I don't have a wireless, uh, compatible wireless charging phone, but I do have a wireless compatible Nintendo 3DS, the uh, new 3DS XL, which I did modify for wireless charging. As you can see, just want to line it up. It's a little difficult with a modded 3DS. Not really difficult, but you have to place it in a certain spot because of the way the coil is lined up inside. Uh, just like that. There you go. And as you can see, the 3DS is charging. And it does have a nice distance on here, too. So, it does charge from quite a distance. As you can see, it's still charging. It's still got a solid light. So, this wireless charger does work. Um, I specifically bought it for my 3DS. I don't have a wireless, charge, uh, wireless charging phone, but I have been using it for my 3DS. It fits on here nicely, and um, it does work pretty well. Um, 
I have no complaints. I've tried some of the smaller circular charging pads, which don't really work that great for me because of the size of the 3DS, as you can see here. Now, this charging pad is about the size of a iPhone 7, uh, standard 7, 4.7 inch, or, um, yeah, 4.7 inch, 5 inch phone. Yeah, so about, about the size of an uh, iPhone 7, iPhone 6, or a Galaxy S6, or S7. So that's about the basic size of it. It's got a very nice feel to it. Feels quality built. Doesn't really feel cheap. Very nice product here, and it works for my intended purposes, as long as I can line the uh, line it up correctly, because of the way that the charging coil is inside of the 3DS. Now, if you guys are interested in this product, I will leave a review or a uh, link down below, and uh, you guys can pick this up. I'll post the cheapest possible price I can find on this product. Um, now, I am offering a little service if you guys are interested in getting a modded Nintendo 3DS XL, new Nintendo 3DS XL, um, I'll leave my email down below and uh, I'll send you the details if you're interested. I can mod it for you with a full warranty. So if you guys have any questions or comments, leave those down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will catch you guys on the next one.